Let me show you on this video how to connect your Bunny CDN to your WordPress site so you can take full advantage of it. Now, in this case, we're going to create a pool zone on Bunny and we're also going to install it on a WordPress site. So let's go start right now. What's up, everyone? I'm going to show you how to install Bunny CDN on your WordPress site. Now, if you don't know what a CDN is, it's a content delivery network system. That means that it's going to make your site load faster from any point of the world because it's going to use the power of Bunny CDN. Now, it's fantastic for any type of site. If you have a slow hosting system, it's going to speed it up because it's going to load part of that site from the CDN. And if, it if it's a fast system, well, it's going to reduce the server load using that CDN. So in this case, I am using a WordPress site that's hosted on Hostinger. And before I show you how to do the whole process of creating the pool zone and the installation, let me show you the sponsor for this video, which is Hostinger. They have great shared hosting plans that can take full advantage of that CDN. Now, in this case, I'm going to show you a coupon code that's going to reduce the price on your hosting plan. So jump over to the link in the description, jump to hosting, go to web hosting, and you're going to be able to find all their shared hosting plans available here. They have plans from $2.99 a month from $9.99 a month. Now, I recommend the most popular one, which is $3.99 a month. So let's go ahead and add this one to cart to add that coupon code. Now, once you're here, you're going to be asked how many months do you want to pay in advance? I recommend 48 months. You get two months free. You get the lowest price. You lock in the lowest renewal price and you're going to go for 48 months. So definitely recommend this price right here. So once you're down here, you're going to see that the price is $191.52. But if you add my coupon code, which is SAS Master and apply it, the price is going to drop to $172.37. So if you plan to grab a shared hosting plan, use my coupon code. And it does work on BPS also. So let's jump over to the WordPress site. Like I said, we're going to be able to install our Bunny CDN on a WordPress site. Now, there's two ways to do this. You can install the plugin that's a dedicated plugin from Bunny.net or you can use your cache plugin to enable it there. I'm going to show you both ways here. Now let's jump over to our bunny.net and we're going to be able to create the pull zone right here. So in this case, we are going to click on add and you have several options here. What we need is a pool zone. Okay. Now in this case, we're going to name it. It needs to be unique because it's using their domain for now, but we can use the DNS and customize it to our own domain. So in this case, I'm just going to put something really random to use it right now. And you can use the origin time, origin URL or storage zone. In this case, we want to use origin URL and we want to push, put the link from our main domain link. So in this case, I am going to use my domain, which is sasmaster.net. Here we go. You can choose the tier. So you got standard tier and high volume tier. So if you are trying to use a CDN because you have stored videos, then I definitely recommend high volume tier. So it's less expensive. But if you want to use the fastest one, use this one. Okay. And then you have the option for the price zine zones. So you can use all these pool zones from Europe, North America, South America, etc. But if you want to keep it cheap, let's just say that you don't need clients from North America because you are based in Europe and you don't care from any other country Then just go ahead and enable Europe. And it's going to be zero one cents per gigabyte use, which is super cheap. But if you do care for con uh, clients from all the world, enable all of these. OK, so let's add the pool zone. And once we do so, we have the instructions to add it. So there's different instructions for different types of sections. For example, custom installation on a WordPress site, on Joomla, on Drupal. In this case, we're just going to skip the instructions and we're going to get this link right here. Now, if you want to add your own custom domain, go ahead and do so from here. Let's add the custom domain here. So I'll just wing it there. Here we go. And here's the settings for the DNS. So you can use your custom domain. In this case, I'm not going to use it. We're going to use the original one in this case. Okay, so we're going to need this link to use the CDN on our WordPress site. So again, like I said, you can use the Bunny plugin or you can use a cache plugin to do this. So in this case, the Bunny plugin is right here. I'm going to click on it and it's pretty much straightforward. It's already enabled here on this site, but all you have to do is add this right there. And that's all. Or if you use the custom domain, add that domain there. You can exclude what files you don't want it to use the content delivery network system. You can include directories and if you want to use API key optional, disable CDN for admin users and update the settings and you're good to go. Just like that, it's going to use the content delivery network from Bunny. Super easy to do. OK, now in this case, let me go ahead and disable the plugin and let me show you if you would do this on a cache plugin. 
So let me go ahead and find here this bunny sable. Why wouldn't I use the bunny plugin? Because I'm using a cache plugin and I don't, I want to avoid one less plugin to be installed here. Okay. So in this case, my, my cache plugin is WP Rocket. If you're using anything else, it does have the CDN settings. Go into CDN. In this case, it's right here. And again, just like we did over there on the bunny plugin, we're going to add that link right here. So if it's hypothetically saying that's the link, we just go ahead and add it there and save it. Do you want it to work on all files or just images or just CSS or JavaScript or CSS? You can enable it here or for all files like I have it right now. But it's super easy to integrate Bunny CDN in your WordPress site. Either you use their built plugin or use it in a cache plugin right there. So there you go. That is Bunny CDN. If you want to check it out, the link we provided in the description. And if you plan to grab a hosting plan, use my coupon code SASMaster. And that's a wrap.